So did you guys think just because I saw the Demon Slayer movie a week ago and I made a video on it that I was just done talking about Demon Slayer until season two came out that I was just off the Demon Slayer hype train forever? Because I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. I have not been able to think about anything else but this goddamn Demon Slayer movie ever since I saw it for the first time, bro. Funny thing enough is that yesterday I actually went to the theaters again to watch it. And this is the first time I've ever rewatch the movie in theaters bro like it's kind of crazy like i love this movie so much bro like i don't care what anybody says about this dude like i don't care if people say it's overhyped or whatever the hell i fucking love this movie to death man i love that boy rengoku but you guys already read the title you guys probably saw the thumbnail man so you guys probably know what we're about to do today right we about to go check out big bro rengoku in that motherfucking mugen dude i know a lot of people are always asking for the Mugen. I know Mugen is kind of like a, a rarity on the channel now. I don't do it as often as much. I've explained this before, but you know, today is a very special day because obviously I, I just, I cannot get Rengoku in this Demon Slayer movie out of my head. So I want to definitely do some type of video, you know, commemorating it. So we about to go check out Rengoku in our Mugen and hopefully, you know, he, he comes up with some W's, man. But we about to see today. But yeah, guys, make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. It's super easy. It takes like one second. Of course, guys can always change your mind later. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter if you haven't already. But nonetheless, let's get it. All right, so for the first battle, we got Rengoku against that boy Kaneki from Tokyo Ghoul, man. I haven't really spent too much time with this Rengoku Mugen. I've, I've seen like a battle or so. And I'm gonna keep it real. Like Rengoku, this Mugen's actually really solid and it's really true. I believe he has like all the attacks that we've seen in the movie, like his ninth form, which... He names literally after himself, which is, if that isn't like the dopest shit ever, man, this man is so clean. He named his, one of his most powerful attacks, literally his own name, bro. But okay, you know, Rengoku, he got it like that, man. You know, like I said before, dude, I'm turning into a goddamn Rengoku fan account, bro. This man made me like, like more, he, he, he made me like love him so much with just like a two hour runtime of this movie. But okay, enough of me, you know, fucking praising this man, Rengoku. Rengoku, you, you know, you got to show some stuff right now, man. Kaneki, he's kind of, he, he's kind of giving you the hands. Um, by the way, guys, um, if for the people that have a, oh, I think that's a counter. Yeah. Uh, Rengoku kind of ran into that one. That's fine though. I really hope, honestly, I'm gonna keep it real, dude. This man, Rengoku already got a special place in my heart. I don't really care if he'd be, he be taking the L's or the W's, man. I just want to see him, you know, use some cool attacks. I just want to see him. I, I, I just miss him, man. You know, you, you guys can understand me. I just miss him, bro. By the way, guys, um, oh, this is ninth form right there. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. let's go. Let's go, Rengoku. Goddamn. Ooh, that's a big chunk of health, though. Okay. That's a huge chunk of health, man. By the way, guys, um, for the people that have seen the demon slayer movie let me know um your favorite moments in, the, in you know in the movie man you know it might it may not even involve rengoku at all it might be you know like tanjo and anosuke doing their thing but you know let me know bro like i said dude I, I think seeing this movie with a bunch of other demon slayer fans you know just a bunch of no other anime fans was truly an experience and man dude like i'm definitely gonna remember that stuff for like the rest of my life man but okay there we go rengoku coming back i think he's gonna pull off with the second round right here which is dope Ooh. Okay, Kaneki, relax, bro. Relax, relax, man. You know, this man getting clean. Okay, there we go, though. There we go. Nice, 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 Rengoku. Also, guys, let me know how hyped you guys are for Demon Slayer Season 2. I believe Season 2 is supposed to release in the fall of this year. And, you know, what is it? Like, fucking oh, summer right now, I believe, or something like that. Or almost summer. So, you know, it should be, like, a couple months away until we get that new Demon Slayer Season, man. And I'm so excited, bro. Because, um, as you guys know, I didn't get to react to the full uh, first season of Demon Slayer here on the channel because at the time I was already watching Demon Slayer and like usually when like series I don't like just jumping into series like midway through but I'm glad that you know Demon Slayer season two I can confidently say that I will be here you know for the first episode whenever it drops I will be here reacting to it on the channel man but okay you know hold on yo Rengoku we got this bruh it's a it's, it's it's a close match close match right now Kaneki chill that's a counter okay Rengoku we didn't fall for it that's good Oh my god, he got that range though. Kaneki do got that range with oh my god, okay. Ooh! Rengoku, you got this! You got this! Come on, brother! Come on! Oh my god, that range is nasty. Rengoku! Oh my god, that range! He's not dead! Rengoku! Ooh! You see the health? Guys, I know you guys see the health right there. I actually jumped out of my seat. I don't got the camera right now, but I jumped out of my seat, bro. This man Rengoku got a sliver of health left. That's the boy right there, man. That's the motherfucking G right there. All right, for the next match, we got Trunks, Dragon Ball Super. He got a sword too, just like Rengoku, man. But yo, 
that last match dude i'm not gonna lie to you you boys went a little bit man it was getting it was like getting a little bit too down to the wire but that boy rengoku did pull through i really like this rengoku mugen a lot man it's really true his character has a all the sound effects are dope too they're not like fucking you know like ear rape like some other characters he's just like it's it's nice man you know it's a really solid and nice mugen and just like always guys i will link the um i'll link the uh the character below for the people that do have mugen if you guys want to go go ahead and download rengoku for yourself but um did you guys hear about um the goddamn sony leaking the demon slayer movie on uh the playstation store bro i know some of you guys probably got that shit downloaded right now like on some torrent type beat i know some of you out there probably you know you guys probably got that movie you know <laughs> but i just like it, it's just so fun oh okay okay i think that was the i think that was like his tiger thing i think that was like the fifth form i believe oh rengoku's too nice with it bro rengoku's too nice with it i'm gonna keep it real though like it, i know a lot of people oh my god trunks pulling out the oh he shit I thought that was it. oh my god i forgot i forgot all the dragon ball characters have this seizure attack see this is the problem with not doing mugen for a while is that i forget a bunch of these attacks that these people be doing i always get blinded and i apologize guys if you get blinded as well but what i was saying is like i know a lot of people you know like if, if they can see the movie those oh my god trunks i'm trying to explain to the people right okay like i was saying <laughs> I know a lot of people, like, if they can see the Demon Slayer movie, they're gonna see it, you know, like, on some Kiss anime, on some Nine anime type beat, or some Torrent type beat, I know. But, like, guys, trust me, you know, if you got some spare money, bro, by the way, Rengoku did win this fight, make sure to go see the Demon Slayer movie in theaters, bro. I, trust me, it's just, it's a different experience watching it with some, with, with some people, you know, you know, in the theaters, on the big screen, man, it's just, it's life-changing. All right, we got another Swordsman against Rengoku right now. We got Kirito from Sword Art Online. I, I don't think I've ever, I, I can't even remember. Have I ever even played against the Kirito Mugen before? I really don't remember, man. Okay, Kirito, relax, bro. This, hold on, this Kirito Mugen is kind of saucy. I'm not gonna lie, though. God damn, dude, Kirito is aggressive as hell. Chill out. Also, guys, another question. Let me know who your favorite character in Demon Slayer is, man. Obviously, I, I, Demon Slayer is another one of those rare series where like, okay, uh, Goku, please. Demon Slayer is another one of those like rare series where I actually like really like the main character a lot. Like it, like in terms of like, they're my favorite character. Like I, I think Tanjiro is still my favorite character. I, I would put Rengoku probably at my second. Okay, Rengoku, you know, he lost his first round, but that's all good, dude. We've been taking Ws. You know, one little loss here and there, ain't, you know, ain't too big of a deal, but you know, another series, like, like uh, I know, like, uh, in Black Clover, Ost is my favorite kill. Ooh, the ninth form again. He missed, bro. No, Kirito really dodged the ninth form like that. But yeah, like, like a couple of other animes that, like, my favorite character is, like, the, usually the main character is, like, My Hero Academia. Like, I like Midoriya a lot. Black Clover, it's, like, Asta. Demon Slayer, it's Tanjiro, man. It's it's usually really rare, man. Attack on Titan, I really like Eren a lot. Eren has always been my favorite in Attack on Titan. I know everyone, like, always jumped on the leave at China when it first started airing. And it looks like Rengoku is going to take this L for this match against Kirito, which is fine. Which is fine, man. Totally fine. Like I said, I don't really care if he takes L's or W's, man. I just want to see my man do some motherfucking work, right? All right, for the next one, we got Android 21 from Dragon Ball Fighters against that boy Rengoku. Oh, that counter was nasty, though. Okay, Rengoku, I see you. But like, but like I was saying, like sometimes with like shonen anime, especially like you sometimes I do tend to like kind of like the I, I not really like the side characters in, in specific, but like kind of like like for example like if people have seen jojo part five right like in my opinion i i bruno is my favorite character from jojo part five instead of J giorno i don't know man i guess it's it's kind of specific i know like a lot of people in anime like kind of like the cool badass characters but i don't know sometimes you know i like going with the classics man you know like the main character you know they're dope okay that's fine you know android 21 i mean that was it was pretty of a close match you know it's, it's cool there we go rengoku the thing is with Rengoku, though, I would say this, is that Rengoku doesn't have a lot of, um... He doesn't have, a, like, a lot of ranged attacks, and I'm not gonna lie, I am putting him against, like, a lot of, like, ranged characters that shoot, like, key blasts and whatnot, but once Rengoku can get in close, like, I feel like he got the, the advantage. Well, Kirito kind of did, you know, give us the hands right there, but... Y you know what I'm saying, you know, that, that Kirito move was kind of aggressive. Ooh, the ninth full! <laughs> oh, you love it! Oh my god, dude. Yo, that was so clean. Rengoku really finished Android 21 off with that goddamn ninth form, dude. Another thing about Demon Slayer that I'm really excited for is just to see um, more of the Hashira in action because, you know, they all got introduced 
in like the you new know, like the tail end of season one but like we've only really seen like tomioka shinobu and now rengoku in action and you know we still have like six more hashira you know i believe in i believe in season two uh tengen the sound hashira is supposed to be kind of like one of the uh the main uh characters in that arc so i'm excited for that by the way rengoku took the w once again man let's Go, dude, Rengoku, he's so goaded, bro. Rengoku, as I like to call him. All right, and this is gonna be the last match right here. So we got our boy Tanjiro joining Rengoku's side, of course. And we're, we're against Edward from Full Metal Alchemist and Natsu from Fairy Tale right now. Also, another thing that I've, I, I I did um before. Oh my God, I forgot Natsu has this like fucking fire punch barrage that he does. There we go. But yo, the, we got the dynamic duo right here. We got Tanjo and Goku, dude. These are the brothers right here, man. And if you guys have been, you know, checking out the channel recently, I've been trying to do a lot more like different types of videos like manga and like more like general like discussions and reviews and whatnot. One thing that I've been reading recently, or I guess like I'm almost finished reading because it's only two chapters, is like this Rengoku Gaiden backstory for Rengoku, man. This is one thing I kind of wish that maybe they included in like an episode before um watching the movie or maybe just included in the movie a little bit Be because i'm reading the rank goku backstory and like some of this stuff would have hit a lot harder like like if i watched the movie like some stuff in the movie would have hit a lot harder like knowing the backstory beforehand but like it's all good but like i'm enjoying this backstory right now even if it's just two two chapters you know just seeing more rank goku is always good right but tanjiro you gotta care right now this boy natsu is really like this boy natsu is nasty i'm not gonna lie man like these fucking fire punches that he be doing is Fucking ridiculous. Tanjiro, you gotta head up, headbutt this man, bro. Look at this. Yo, I love how Tanjiro really just spams that headbutt, bro. Like, it looks so goofy. Ooh, you see that jump? Okay. Come on, Tanjiro. Damn, that damage is kind of not good, though. What is that? Like, why does the attack look so cool, but it does, like, zero damage? It, it, it either does, like, barely no damage at all, or Natsu is, like... Oh, my God. See, even when we're blocking that, I feel like... Natsu did way more damage with that than oh my good lord. Okay, Natsu, that's you know that's that's totally fine, man. You know you can take this win. Like I was saying, it's either Natsu has like ten bajillion defense or Tanjiro is just super weak. Which I, I think Natsu really just has that defense. Because look, yo yo yo, look at this. We got the tag team go. Oh my god, the health is gone, bro. See that attack right there is so ridiculous, bro. It's not only like the range is the range is nasty, but like also the damage. Oh, it's definitely. Oh, never mind. Natsu definitely has like a Omega defense because Tanjiro did that one attack right there and literally Edward got annihilated, bro. Okay, come on. We got it's 2v1 right now. We can win this against Natsu for sure. Ooh, okay. That, that okay. Okay, Rengoku has a little bit. Of, ooh, the ninth form. Let's go, Rengoku. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Man, I've been loving it, dude. Rengoku's been doing his ulti a lot lately. Okay, but I think we're going to win this match, you know, no matter what. Uh, oh, we're definitely going to win this round, but. I feel like we're gonna win this match if we can kind of just do what we did uh at the beginning right there kind of getting it get them get them in the middle i think we got this all right come on boys i have faith in you you got this okay that's fine okay rengoku's getting jumped right now tanjiro okay he's charging a meter that's fine he can get in there oh okay that's fine there we go he did that same thing he did that same thing to edward like he did before in the last round Ooh. There we go. There we go, man. Get him in the corner. Get him in the corner. Oh, we got him in the middle again. It's over. It's over. We got him in the middle. Okay, okay. He kind of flopped right there. I'm not going to lie. Okay, I, I think we're going we're gonna to take Edward out for sure. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. We need to take Edward out fast and go help Tanjiro. This man, Edward. Come on, bro. Oh, this man making it kind of annoying to kill him right now really dude really this man is just jumping oh my god we just ran into the attack too no way okay that's fine okay edward's taking out good okay now we can focus on natsu all right rengoku you gotta help him out bro okay there we go there we go yeah that defense is ridiculous man that, that defense really do be kind of od now we got him we're jumping him right now Oh, okay, okay. Good shit. We canceled out that attack. I think we got this, guys. We got this. This is it. This is it. Jump him. Oh, yeah. That's GG's. That's GG's right there. We got him. Who's going to land the final attack? It's going to be Tanjiro? No? But, but let it be Rengoku, man. Let it... Who's going who's gonna to land it? It's going to be Tanjiro. Okay. He got the, what is that? Fucking water wheel. Okay. Let's go, dude. And then Rengoku's just standing over Nazis. 
dead body right there. Oh, man, dude. This was such a fun ass Mugen, dude. Yeah, everybody, that's gonna do it for the Mugen video today. I hope you guys did enjoy, man, seeing that boy Rengoku in action. I really enjoyed this Rengoku Mugen a lot. Really entertaining, really true to his, you know, like his moves in the in the movie and stuff like that. You know, it's a really solid movie. Like I said, I'll leave the link to the character down below in the description, guys. Make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. It's super easy. It takes like one second. Of course, you guys can always change on my later. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter if you haven't already, everybody. But uh, yeah, guys, like I said before, thank you guys so much for all the love and support recently on the videos. It really means the world to me. But it's been you, Wire, guys, and I'm out. Peace.